we've got Dr. Mario versus Joker here. Uh, so we've got a top tier and we have uh, Joker. Ba -da 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 -da. Oh, okay, it looks like... Oh, it looks like, actually, Lido Lewis went to Game 3, I think. But, back to the set. We're going to... Ha so, yeah, so... Okay, so it looks like Lido beat Muppet. I uh, beat uh, sorry, Lido beat Lou. Um, as as I got distracted doing Teal stuff, uh, it looks like JJ was able to call out the down B and punish with an up smash, but he did lose um, Arsene afterwards. Hello, Shawnee T. Uh, it does look like G is throwing out smash attacks a bit, but that up smash is gonna connect and is going to take the stock. Uh, he is known behind by 65% and decrease, uh, increasing, but 74% now, 92. But at the same time, it, this is Doc. He can build up the damage pretty quickly. Uh, the, the third down tilt not able to connect. Um, he's hitting all these up smashes. So Nam is going to join me back on commentary again after he finishes his dinner. Um, and that down smash killed! I feel like JJ mustn't have DI'd that really well. I'm not really sure what character he was playing, it was off stream. And oh, unfortunate recovery from G. Uh, this is suddenly a really close game. Oh. Good up throw upper right? and he's got a little bit upset on him, but he is going to take loads from that side B. How's he recovering? He is able to make it. G's recoveries have really made Doc almost look viable. Much to Muppet's uh, probable chagrin. And uh, going to be a yeet from G there. And that should be our send gone, yes. So... G is behind by a solid like 40%, but this is Dr. Mario we're talking about. Um, he is ins he has pretty absurd kill power, and G has been able to get stocks when really behind before. Remember, he was at 160% when he beat Lumen Game Two uh, in his la winner set, but does land slightly above the ledge uh, on stage and is going to. Oh, I had it as Jiffy instead of JJ. I, my apologies. I am completely not on the ball with the um, stream today. I'm so sorry. Uh, this is loser side. We're doing this one loser set before we stream winners semis. Uh, Muppet beat G2 off stream. So, yeah, G just unfortunately landing on stage instead of grabbing Legendary. And does uh, lose game one because of it. So yeah, next on stream after this set is going to be Lido versus Muppet. Lido having beat Lou two one. I don't know how close it was, but presumably at least a little bit. I think Lido went to cloud game three. So we've got no characters changes here. Makes sense. Uh, G said he was going solo doc today. JJ is a Joker main as well. So, FD, interesting choice. I'm not really too sure why um, FD. I guess G probably just doesn't want those platforms for any particular... Like, he doesn't want a lot of the Joker juggles. But I'm not really too sure. I don't know enough about either character, unfortunately. And yeah, that up B is going to get punished, but... Okay, uh, JJ is doing a good job of keeping G in the air, making it hard for him to return on stage. And that up smash out of shield can continue to be really good. I apologise when I said Doc only had four options earlier, so he has five. And ooh, that 
Down smash is going to take the stock there. Pretty early as well. Oh, G gone, went pretty deep for Doc, but still had a stock. So, unsafe down B. That looked very like a Rob side B, the way he used that. And, GG wasn't really able to do much damage, even with RSM there. Ye but, we've now got Joker juggles going on, so, is G gonna land? Yes, that now lasts. Eight, literally 800 years and oh really good catch on the roll with that up smash uh, only 50% deficit um, I feel like G needs to start playing more of a grab based game here he's getting punished for a lot of his jumps and he keeps going for the power approaches which then also just get punished by uh, Rebels Guard but good recovery again from G Every time I think he's just too far away, he makes it an Oh my god, the rando Mario Online S-Smash does it. But he reads the tech roll, um, and JJ just doesn't tech, so he's safe from the up-smash. Oh, nice rising there from G. And good pill to clank out the nerf from JJ into the up-smash. Oh no, sorry, into the down B. And yeah, G... He's been playing like every stock from behind and oh my god, how did he not have time to grab that? That's so unfortunate to see. But G just I look away literally for two seconds and G takes that stock. Um, because G just enjoys Doc and Doc is like his secondary. He like, he enjoys Doc and I think it's a part of like the fact that Pika isn't the most fun to play online. I can respect it. But yeah, G with a... S not a massive lead, but... Oh, it's growing now, though, from that pill conversion. But yeah, G with a lead, suddenly. And, oh, he gets a parry, but Doc's grab range is just so bad. So he doesn't able to get the yeet. Down through... Uh, but does get down through a down B. And Arsene's almost gone. And then he punishes the neutral... Get, get up with an up smash and... G takes the game two. We're going to game three here, guys. Uh, if anyone wants to check the bracket, there's the link. Also, an important message from our sponsor. I'm your sponsor. Hello. Hello. Well, I was I was more meaning the fact that I have a trans rights command, but also that works. <laughs> that's I like that a lot. That's good. Anyway, uh, I was still watching the match, and so uh, yeah, mad adaptation from G. Yeah, um, I would say I feel like JJ has a bit of a spot dodge habit. Yeah, he does. Like, and also he tends to roll away quite a lot. Um, but I, I feel like G is. Pretty good. I, I don't think I've seen him capitalize on it this set, but um, he, G is good. Yeah, he is. It is good to see that G started using more grabs like I wanted, but also he did a lot of shield grabs as opposed to dash ones, so obviously the yeah. frame Ugh. data plus terrible grab range just meant not the best of luck with him. Yeah, I, I saw that um, I saw that uh, grab whiff earlier. I was like, ah, no, that, that should not have whiffed. That was... Ugh. Smash Luckily, ultimate, baby! <laughs> yeah, I mean, I don't have to worry about that, because Greninja's got a chunky grab, like... <laughs> I miss Smash Bros. where Greninja's grab just, like, didn't exist. Tragic. It was I nice. Think. I mean, Greninja I... was oh, still just as good, but... It was nice for him to have uh, that issue. I, um... I heard that... Red Sparks, 100%. <laughs> oh! Wait, did he just spike him? Yeah! Because yeah. I was updating the bracket thing. How is G hitting one of like the like I hate that sp like I love the animation of that spike but it's really slow and it doesn't look like it's got the biggest hitbox and G keeps is, hitting it. The thing is, because like alright for Ganon and Captain Falcon, it kind of yeah. the spike hitbox kind of works because he's got like um they've got big you know, yeah. legs. Matt Dark Mario's got like little stubby. Yeah, things, exactly. But and the thing is, he keeps getting them on characters you traditionally can't edge guard. He's good. He's getting ready for mm. these rebel guards now. Which was yeah, an then, issue he was facing a lot at the start of last game. Did you see, um, you just, you read the, uh, just tech on, tech on place on, um, platform? 
Before yeah, he did. Like, G's reads have been so on point. And I mean, they have to be when you play a, a character like Doc, who is really read heavy because he's just like he has pill confirms, but he's struggles so you, much you at want everything. That, like up smash yeah. read, to be honest. Yeah, which he's going for yeah. a lot, which is good. G able to live long enough that uh, it gives Joker a kill through. <laughs> uh. Joker's skip both down throw and back throw. Traditionally, obviously, oh. only kill around. And oh, that down throw down be not true and does get punished ah, by the um, frame three counter. Right, back throw, not gonna kill. Close though. Ooh, yeah, this, this, this Doctor Mario is like nothing, nothing to mess with. How does he keep? Stuff. How does he keep making these recoveries? And yeah, he punishes that landing as well with the upsides. She's completely adapted from game one. I if know, he was like, like oh, does he have a jump? Yeah. I think that back air might. Oh be. yeah, but he, he didn't have a jump, but he's just he he makes Doctor Mario look like um, Sakurai and team remembered yeah. to give the character a recovery. <laughs> it's very yeah, interesting. I feel like it's oh nice. Good. Yeah, he, I like that he waited as well. He didn't immediately go for the grab. He waited to s and reacted instead of going for a read. Yeah. Oh. Well, yeah, but that, yeah, that backer, yeah, that backer so just gonna kill that Scanandor for you, baby. <laughs> um, and G needs to be careful because Arsene can do some silly shit. But oh, he should Arsene. be fine. Yeah, really good use of the cape. Obviously, it doesn't start with Doc, but it did save him from the bullets. Oh, oh no. but on. Oh, really good call up from JJ. Yeah, that, was, that was a to, good call. That was like yeah. actually perfect timing. Yeah, uh, perfect timing on that S-Mash. Good read as well, and JJ just takes it. So, I mean, you know, imagine losing with top tier like Dr. Mario, you know? <sighs> Especially to a low tier as well, like mm -hmm. um, Joker. You know how it goes. Okay, we're going to have Muppet versus...